In order to calculate torque changes to the driven gear, you input the torque from the drive gear. In this case, it's 150 foot pounds. Then you multiply that by the gear ratio of 3.25. That gives us a value of 4.87. Now that gets rounded to 488 foot pounds. Now let's try that on a few more. Let's look at the problem on the right. Here we have an input foot pound of 98. So we input the 98 into the calculator, hit the multiply symbol, and now enter the gear ratio of 2.56. That gives us a 250.88 foot pounds. Now that's going to get rounded to 251 foot pounds because we round to a whole number when we deal with torque changes. Let's take a look at the problem below. We now have an input foot pounds of 210. So we input that into the calculator. Once again, hit the multiply symbol. And then we enter the gear ratio of 1.87. Hit the equals. And we have 392.7. And that is going to be rounded to 393 foot pounds. And finally, to the overdrive gear ratio. The overdrive input is 198 foot pounds. We multiply that by the gear ratio of 0.72. That will equal 142.56. That will get rounded to 143. Here we can see once again that when we have gear reduction in the first three, we get a torque increase and the overdrive, we get a torque decrease.